Hello everyone, my name is Oshin Nagy and I am a operations consultant and I'm sitting down with Kevin Franz who is the founder of the Momentum Consulting Group in the United States. Thank you very much for spending some time with me. You're welcome, glad to be here. Um, how does a great system look like? Well, a great system needs to be simple and it needs to be understood and it needs to, to be congruent. What I mean by congruent, it needs to be able to have go from one functional area of a company to another uh, because otherwise it's like a siloed mentality and a company is run then, you know, not in a systematic approach. So what I would tell people is develop systems and processes that meet your business needs. Don't over-engineer something, don't over-complicate things because as your business grows, your processes, your procedures, they'll all grow with you. What is the biggest challenge you face when you're setting up a system or process within your business? One, we have, you know, is trying to really define what that process is and is are we trying to make something more complicated than what it needs to be? Or is it because we're defining it so it can be an executable, repeatable process, which is what it should be? And if you're going to, when I say you, if any company is going to get scale at any time, they're going to have to have uh, repeatable processes. And so that's what you want to try to get to at the end of the day, is to develop policies and procedures that and processes that uh, are really simple, are clear, are reviewed frequently, to make sure that they're still relevant. And if they're not, either get rid of them or make adjustments to them. And Make sure you train your people. I mean, I see this so often. Though. People don't train their own staff, and you know, we set up employees oftentimes as employers to fail. So, as an employer, we have a big obligation to make sure people understand that how what I do affects you, and what you do affects the next person, and the next person. That's, that's there's a big disconnect. On it. Yeah, it happens quite often. Quite yeah. often, yeah. yeah. Maybe, they, maybe there is a there is a champion who, or someone, an accountability person who is accountable yeah. for the certain process. That absolutely, that helps. It, someone needs to own the process because if they don't own the process, then they there's everybody needs an accountability, and somebody needs to be able to say, yes, this is working. No, it's not. And uh, or it's not being followed. And if it's not being followed, why? Is it because it's not relevant? Is it because of lack of training? Is it because it's um, it's too complicated? So somebody needs to own that process. And, and I, what I see in very highly successful companies is people need to understand the upstream and downstream. And what I mean by that is how what I do. Uh, affects the next two and three people and what you do of how that affects the next two and three people. So if people see how the chain link fence is built, Absolutely. then they understand that, okay, well, if this is the weak link and if it's not coupled right, it's it's going to break and the, the whole chain is not going to work effectively. So we try to educate companies on, it's just not about me and my department. But what you do in your department affects the department B, C, D, all the way to the outcome of the customer. Absolutely. So. Would you recommend a consultant when, to analyze a business and setting up processes there? Absolutely. Uh, having a consultant um, set up processes, procedures, policies is critical because it's a fresh set of eyes. And I often use the analogy, it's, you can't see the picture because you're the picture frame. And, you know, as a business owner, uh, we often can be too close to our own business. And and we should be very close to our own business, but we have then our blinders on. And we're not seeing beyond those blinders. It's kind of like a race horse, you know, that race horse is just focused on running, you know, down the track. But uh, we may not be, the jockey may not be steering that horse correctly. So, yes, absolutely. I think everybody should have a consultant come in and look at a lot of different things and have that on a continuum because uh, 
it comes with a fresh perspective. It comes with, a, uh, with often new approaches. It's like you have a lot of aha moments. Like I never thought about that. One. And uh, uh, so, yes, having a consultant is very important. Yeah, Kevin, thank you so much. You're welcome. I'm glad to do it. Glad to be here. Good to see you. Good to see you.